Hi YouTube, welcome to my channel. My name is Jasenia and today I'll be showing you guys how to get this very glam red look. Not sure what I'm going to call it yet, but it's going to be something red. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, just please keep on watching. My eyes are already primed, so I'm going to go in with the Morphe um, 35C and this red right here. Now with a Morphe little pencil brush, it doesn't have a number. And then back again with the M441 and just blend both those colors in. Now on a flat brush and some primer, I'm going to go in with this MAC Red Glitter. It doesn't have a name, but any red glitter will work. And now I'm going to use the NYX Matte Liquid Liner in black. So I just applied um, lashes and mascara. So now I'm going to go with um, Shape Tape in medium. This one's really dark for me, so it works like a corrector. As you'll see, it's super, super like yellow on me. And my inner corner in this eye, it always rejects makeup, so I'm sorry, it looks a little crazy. And with my Real Techniques um, blending sponge, I'm just gonna blend that in. This feels so fat and good. So now my favorite concealer of all time, it's the Bye Bye Under Eye by It Cosmetics in the color medium. I can't use it by itself because it's super light, so it looks a little ashy, but these two together work perfectly. That was a lot, you don't need so much. So I'm gonna put that on both. I'm gonna use this for both eyes. This is a Morphe flat brush. It doesn't have a number, it came in a set. But I'm just using this to spread out the product. By the way, my face was already primed with the Bobbi Brown Hydrating Face Cream. It has a built-in primer, so... So now I'm gonna go on my favorite foundation, Air Flash, in the color 201. I'm just gonna go straight on my face. And with this like foundation brush from Morphe, again, it doesn't have a number because it came in a set. I have a parrot that's right in front of me and knows how to talk. <laughs> just kidding, it's my sister. Oh my god, the freaking train passed. <laughs> and with the arms RCMA No Color Powder on a Morphe. 439 and I'm just gonna pack the brush and just do it like that. Alright then. I like to use this brush to go over my eyebrows because it's not that big. So you gotta like really close to your brows. Okay. So honestly, I don't use another powder. Well, sometimes I do, but for right now, I'm not. I just got the same powder on a Sephora powder brush and just put that everywhere else. And I'm a little bit on the dry side, so I don't bake for too long either. Now with Anastasia Contour Kids and the color. I don't know which kit is this, but I'm pretty sure it's the light one with the middle color. Let's go here and scope your cheeks. On our blending brush, this literally doesn't have a number. It's from like TJ Maxx. 
I like to come to my room. Neighbors are not playing rancheras. They, <laughs> <laughs> they usually play rancheras every single time this camera turns on, and I'm like, you're kidding me. Now with a Bobbi Brown face blender brush, I'm gonna go in with a Bobbi Brown golden light um, bronzer and just bronzer. So now I'm gonna go in with a Bobbi Brown blush in the color Poppy. Poppy. On a Morphe E4 brush. By the way, if you have glitter fallout, just use tape to take it off. Just like go like that with the tape. And it works wonders. My little sister just told me to do that. Because I literally had red glitter everywhere. And now for highlight, we're gonna go in with one of my favorites. The Jeffree Star King Tut on a Morphe M501 and also with Bobbi Brown Pink Glow. King Tut's a little bit too dark for me, so I like to mix it with Pink Glow and it gives me like a full, like, it kind of calms it down. So now for the bottom, I'm gonna go in with the Renaissance palette and this color right here. On a Morphe M507. And just like smoke it out. And with my favorite mascara, the L'Oreal Telescopic, I'm gonna coat my bottom lashes a little bit. And for the lips, I'm gonna um, go in with Mannequin and Celebrity Skin by Jeffree Star. First, I'm gonna go in with Celebrity Skin. And I'm gonna put Mannequin in the middle just a little bit. And Okay, we're done. So I'm gonna change and I'll be right back. Oh, just kidding, we're not done. <sighs> we're gonna set our face with Fix Plus. Don't put this like super close to your face because it will take off your makeup. So just from the front. Oh, and now that we are done with the makeup look, I'm gonna change and I'll be right back. So this is the finished look, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I know this is my first YouTube video, but I promise that I will post more frequently. And yeah, so if you enjoyed this, please don't forget to subscribe and comment anything that you want. So yeah, I hope to see you guys all on my next video. Have a happy, happy new year. And I'll see you guys all in my next video.